Hey guys, Kyle the Death Knight of Enemy here, bringing you my review for My Hero Academia Chapter 237. And I, and I, I, I pretty much, now, now in terms of this chapter, I, 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 I feel, uh, now in terms of the, of this week, of this chapter, I, I feel this whole chapter, it, it can be defined in one sentence. A single helping hand can change a life. And I feel there really is no, uh, there, there, there is no other way there is no other way to view shake 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 Araki's life after killing his family cuz really if one person one fucking person had just looked beyond his outward appearance and actually saw how torched he was underneath and 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 how much he he was pretty much crying for help then maybe just maybe he then maybe just maybe he 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 honestly honest, he, he probably could he probably could have lived a life different from the one he he, he current he easily has i mean it it, it, it again it, it's and, and but at the same time like it's also one of those things where a, 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 lot, a lot of all the, the Oh, that that probably his that probably his his a lot a lot of his inner torture is probably the reason as to why no one helped him that they were pretty much afraid of him afraid of him because of afraid of him because of how how tortured he looks he looked but really in but really in that in that situation of him in that situation of of him being of him of him of him be, of him being so of him of him, him pretty much feeling absolutely tortured and and broken you 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 you'd, th you'd think that 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 you think that 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 in itself it would actually open the door in order for people to actually help him but no and it and at the yet at the same but it didn't and at the same time the, the biggest irony once again in in all of this is that the kindest and most helpful hand didn't come from someone in this hero society, but rather the most notorious villain in its history. And I really like—I I really like the idea. What? What? How? I really like the idea of basically how how, how, how Puro Shigaraki's hands, the the hands that uh, uh, that Puro Shigaraki had covered his body with, they, it pretty much served a lot more of a purpose than 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 than, than, than pretty much just, than than be, even beyond just, just pretty much giving him that personal connection to his family, but actually but actually served in, in order to help him control, uh, help him help him to control help him to control and, and develop his power up to this point. Like I I really like that idea because. I really like that idea because again, as as it was shown from 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 the the from 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 the as as it was proven from like like the very beginning of Shigaraki's origin, a lot of his power is is tied to his emotions. So in in a way, the, yeah, ha, ha, having that having that personal connection, e, e, even if he locked his memories away, it did help. It did help in in developing his powers, so to speak. Um, <clears throat> And yeah, I really like that. But again, it's it, it's just a pure irony about this society how, how the one how the one fucking person who who the one fucking person who who, who actually helped who actually, who actually actually that ended up extending a helping hand a helping a helping hand to a helping hand to shake 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 isn't anyone in the hero society. But again, it was all for one one of the one of the hero societies. Like all time most notorious villains, like just top, like again, that, that like we, we've basically seen a, a lot of moments, a lot of moments throughout the series of of, of the whole of the whole irony and the hypocrisy of this hero society. But to me, like again, that that is one of the absolute epitome of epitomes of this of this whole situ of this whole like situ hero society villain society type situation. Like it really is. <laughs> um... Now, now in this ch now now through this chapter and and, and from through and and from through all and 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 through from seeing all and through seeing like 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 and through seeing the the, the from past the, the a lot more of the past of of of, of, of from Shigaraki's like 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 from time with, with basically all for one, we, we basically also learns of uh, of basically how how from Tenko Shimura ended up becoming ended up becoming. Tom, 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 Tom,
And it's fitting enough that a uh, Prince Tamara would basically mean more considering up to this point he's done he's done nothing but but pretty much secretly mourn the, the death of his family to, even despite locking his true memories away memories and feelings away but holy shit having learned this type of chapter the the having learned this chapter the the the, the, the name of uh, Prince shake 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 Shigaraki is all for one's real last name in itself is epic enough cuz it shows it shows just how much it shows it shows it it shows just how much it shows just how much shake 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 araki values he he values his name he values his name because it was it was it was a personal it was a personal mental that was passed down by his master all all for one and even even more even more than that i do really like even more than that, though, I, with with moments like this, I do really enjoy how 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 post all, all my all how, how the post all all, all all might versus all for one fight. We're actually getting a little clues and breadcrumbs here and there as to who exactly all for one really is, and it's moments like this, like the ones in this chapter, where I find myself more intrigued and invested in his character than any time before. Which, granted, he's a great villain either way, but still, and I do hope this build-up will eventually lead to his return, eventually. And by the end of the chapter, with Shigaraki, with Shigaraki ha having finally destroyed the hands of his family, it felt like the perfect cap to his development, because as, as all for one said, the hands were really just a means to regulate his emotions, and by proxy his power, but now with his full awareness of his memories and past, he doesn't need the, that regulation and can go all unrestrained. Now that now that he has full control of his power, and against Redestro, he's definitely going to need every bit of it. Um, now, one thing I will say about the chapter is that the whole thing with Giganto Machia again did feel like an afterthought. But with this being the final wrap up to Sh Shigaraki's origin, it's more than likely that we are going to see what exactly his overall purpose is going to be now, especially since he seemed only interested in fighting Shigaraki. So. It, so imagine how so imagine how this is gonna go from here is that the fight with Redestro is gonna conclude very soon and then we're gonna have get a very brief fight with, with Shigaraki and Gigantomachia. But um but yeah guys, that's my review. If you enjoyed the video, like, comment, subscribe, I'm on Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram. Then that event anyway, signing off. Later guys.